Hi guys, my name is Joyce and welcome to my channel Sewing with Joyce. I'm from Brazil and I have a sewing channel on YouTube for seven years now and everything there is in Portuguese because it's my born language but I thought to myself, why not translate my videos to English so I can share my tips with more people. So here I am, this is my English channel, I'm still trying to figure it out how I'm gonna translate this video, I hope you guys like it. I made a voiceover my tutorials because this is the way that I do on my Portuguese channel, so I just translate the speaking part and I hope you guys can understand. If you have any tips for me, feel free to leave in the comments below and also if you like this video, subscribe to the channel and also give me a thumbs up. So in this video I'm gonna show you guys how I made a rug for my bedroom. It's a fur rug, it's really simple, easy and quick to make and if you don't have a sewing machine you can stitch by hand the fabrics or you can glue them together but if you have a sewing machine it's gonna be so much faster so enough to chat and let's go to the tutorial I'll start by folding my fur fabric in the middle and then I'll put the measures that I chose for my rug but you can use whatever measure you want these are my measures in centimeters and I also put in inches so you have an idea of the size of my rug you can use any fur that you want Mine is a sheep fabric and it's a really thin fabric and I decided to use felt as my lining for the rug so it will get more structure and I'm just cutting both fabrics in the same size. I open the fabric and put the right sides of the fabric facing up and then I'll pin all the way around because I'm gonna stitch in the sewing machine. If you don't have a sewing machine, you can either stitch by hand or glue the fabrics together. I sew the straight stitch in the far corners of the rug, leaving an opening for about 10 centimeters to turn the right side out. So this is me turning the right side of the fabric out of the hole that I left open and after that I'll put my hand inside of the rug and use my hands to sharpen the corners so it will look better in the outside. After that I'll pin the opening and stitch by hand. Okay, so by now the rug is almost done, but I needed to find a way to make the rug not slip because I could fall if I left in the felt in the floor. So I decided to use a hot glue gun to put hot glue in the felt. This way it will be non-slip, I can step over the rug and I won't fall. So you should do this on your rug or you can buy a non-slip surface and glue in your rug but don't skip this step because it's really dangerous if you just leave the, the fabric in the floor after I glued I was testing to see if it works and it really do work so I decided to put hot glue gun in the all the pieces of the felt just to be sure after that this is how it looks my rug I really love the results it's really comfortable to walk over it and I use the vacuum cleaner to clean the surface of the rug because this fur it gets really dirty <laughs> so I'll just use a vacuum cleaner and I'll be good to go so I really love this rug I hope you guys like this video Okay, so this was today's video. Well, I'm gonna confess to you guys, I thought it was gonna be harder to talk to the camera in English, but I think I'm doing okay, right? <laughs> Leave me in the comments below what you think about this video. If you learned something, please let me know. It's gonna be really helpful for me for my next videos. So that's it. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.